Now let me show you a few tricks about testing the device. If you hold this and take the compass that comes with it, you'll notice that when you hold it close to the center, the speaker that's mounted inside will pull the N towards the top. And that's a North Pole speaker. So that's how you test that. Now there's another way, a more advanced way, to check that your speaker box is working, and it will require a digital multimeter with Hertz setting. If your digital multimeter has HZ, then you're ready to do this experiment. So, I'll take the leads that come with the zapper, and I'm going to attach the alligator clips to the red and black probes of the digital multimeter. So now they're connected. I'm going to connect the 1000 Hz zapper and turn it on. Now, I'm going to put the ground, and I'm going to attach the ground wire to the zapper from the multimeter. And now, this unconnected positive lead acts like an antenna and will actually pick up the thousand hertz right in the air. It's like a beach ball size wave of zapper current above this, this speaker box. And you can see that it says a thousand hertz here. It's a one kilohertz. So that's a thousand hertz. Now if I change the zapper to the 30, because this is a dual frequency zapper, if I change this now it jumps, let's see here, 32 kilohertz, that's where it's jumped to. And if I turn it off, give the meter time to think, and it goes to zero. So that's how you can test if there's a, 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 a zapper frequency above your... Now this rides pretty far. I, I can't get this to not pick up the wave. So you can stack food as high as you can get it to stack on top of this, and that invisible zapper frequency will reach it. The interesting thing about RF frequency is that RF frequency runs through one wire. So that's why the zappicator does not hook up with the ground. It simply hooks up straight to the positive. And it's the magic of RF frequency that does all the work for you. So that's a really interesting way to test that your unit is working properly. Just use the leads from your zapper.